It can be said there are two main types of astrology used today. One is tropical astrology, which is primarily used by Western astrologers. It is the bulk of what you find online and on YouTube. The other, sidereal astrology, is used primarily by the non-Western world by Vedic astrologers. The main difference between these two systems is that tropical astrology uses an adjusted system that does not reflect the actual location of the planets. The location of the planets are adjusted to a theoretical position based on the seasons of the Earth. Sidereal astrology, on the other hand, aims at using the actual location of the planets. True sidereal astrology is the equivalent of going outside and looking up at the night sky to see which constellations the planets are in. Tropical and sidereal astrology refers to the zodiac system used. Tropical bases the location of the zodiac signs around the seasons of the earth. Every spring equinox, tropical astrology adjusts the signs so that the sun is at zero degrees Aries, the beginning of the zodiac. The truth of the matter is the constellations of the zodiac are slightly moving relative to the seasons. The sun does not originate to its exact position in the sky every year relative to the stars. This change is very subtle, about one degree every 72 years, and at the time of this video the tropical zodiac is almost a full sign away from the actual constellations in the sky. An example of this might be that if the sun is in the sign of Virgo in your tropical birth chart, it may have actually been in the constellation Leo at the time of your birth. This slight change between tropical and sidereal systems is commonly referred to as precession. Sidereal astrologers instead aim at using the actual location of the planets in the sky. To achieve this, most sidereal astrologers use what is coined by Vedic astrologers as the Ayanamsa, which represents the beginning of the zodiac and accounts for precession. Since there is no universally agreed on area of where the constellations begin and end, there are a variety of different Ayanamsas used today. The most commonly used by Vedic astrologers is Lahiri. It is important to note that both the Western and Vedic systems use an even 30 degrees for each of the zodiac signs. However, in actuality, the constellations take up larger and smaller portions of the sky and thus have varying degrees. A new form of sidereal astrology is emerging in popularity, which takes into account the actual size of the constellations. This type of sidereal astrology is what I use in my work and is what my videos are based on. To see your true sidereal birth chart, click this link here to use my online sidereal chart calculator. So this was a general look at sidereal astrology. I'll be making additional parts to this video explaining it in more detail. Thank you again for all of your support. If you have any questions, comment down below. If you'd like a personal reading, click the link on the page or to take one of my sidereal astrology courses. Thanks for watching. Take care. See you next time.